had a month break on the beach playing some golf and now back to work as the head coach of the Warriors in year 11. It's different than a seven game series and the pressure different than an NBA Finals game. That's you're expected to win. It's complete failure if you don't come home with the gold. I think and won three titles together. And he told us this DeMar DeRozan hits the jumper that DeRozan's presence will do a lot for Fox. Here's DeRozan with the pull-up jumper. The master of the mid-range is on. Kaminga from deep. Won't fall. Rebound Sabonis. Led the NBA in rebounding the last two years. Changed his number. Went back to number 11 as Fox scores. Turns 37 in March. Gives it up to Pachemski. Nice pass underneath, and Green puts it in. But Jemski just great feel for the game. They were having a discussion in studio about that young man, that ability on fire right there. And Sabonis on the other end. His first shot attempt goes down. Seems like that position's up in the air, either Jackson Davis or Looney. But Draymond Green occasionally playing five. Curry gets to the rim and scores off glass. How much of the action from the Sacramento Kings revolves around Domas at the elbow making decisions. Eight assists per game last year. Nice move by Murray around Looney and a timeout by Steve Kerr. And the fans love what they're seeing offensively early on. When he wasn't in the lineup, they were 13 and 14. With him, 60% of their games they win. You know, it's not a mystery. He unlocks so much on both ends as Steph Curry gets a second basket. You're talking about 13 straight years, four championships together. As Steph Curry drills his second three. There's your answer. You got Curry defending Sabonis now on the switch. Green comes over to help, and Sabonis slams it. Yeah, Sabonis is uh, very willing to mix it up physically. Musa Dagger know what Sabonis was doing already. An emphatic in preseason game number two, a signal by Draymond Green to an official. I'll be very surprised if this group is in top six. Um, I I'm curious what Her Herder's timeline is. Mr. Monk going to work right there individually. I just, I'm curious what the final standings look like in the West in terms of win total and what that means. Anthony Melton from deep knocks down the three. And here's one of them. DeMar DeRozan, after spending the last three seasons with the Bulls, there's Malik Monk, who can catch fire in a hurry. Shot clock at three. DeRozan on the back down, hoists it over Anderson. And everybody knows, shot. Right, and he has to take that because he's under duress of the clock. I think they'd like to shoot 53s. Last year, they averaged 48. They believe Andrew Wiggins is going to have a tremendous year offensively. They'll lean in. Again, Kaminga, I touched on this already. His first game as a king, and he's 5 of 5 on the floor. Where well, they're getting downhill, and they're touching the paint. Green Multiple rattles it home from deep. Another three, the seventh already for Golden State. He's trying to get downhill and get off the dribble. Fox tries to go again there. Here's DeRozan. Hits again. That's a three for DeMar DeRozan. Going to do wonders for a team that does not have a lot of postseason success. Here's Curry letting it fly and hitting a three. That's the third triple, and Curry's got 11 points here in the first half. Gets you. Those matter. This is what we're talking about when we say this guy is the hub. Pajemski hit the deck in a hard lens screen. Monk was wide open and knocked it down. And we'll get you an update when we have it. Three-pointer. Good from Jones. His first points. He is going to score. 13 points on seven shots for Curry here in the first half. Jones banks and a three. He doesn't react. <laughs> It'll just look different now, but I still think they're well positioned. Yeah, Randall got hurt end of January. We didn't see him again. As Sabonis takes it to the rim and flushes it. Year nine for Sabonis. Third full season with Sacramento. As Milton hits a three, they're 12 of 19. Come on, folks. That's not easy for Keegan Murray defensively. Did an excellent job. Now Fox driving. Foul. Count it. The harm by Steph. And an and one for De'Aaron Fox. They can yeah. spread the floor and shoot the ball. Obviously, if Sabonis can do that, 
opens things up for everybody else. And there's another three for Buddy Heald in the 13th for the Warriors. Nobody Speaking. to target on the defensive end. All five starters were very good individual defensive players as Melton continues the shooting for this team. By Murray on the look from Sabonis. I think all of these players know that their run is coming in this first 24 minutes. Your survey that just came out, the overwhelming favorites to repeat. Yeah. We have not had a repeat champ since the Warriors 2017-2018. Sabonis hits the mid-range shot again. Because <laughs> these two teams look good. <laughs> Here's Heald, another one. It's again, Buddy Heald. Six of six. See over there saying you guys might want to save some of this for a couple <laughs> weeks from now. Fox in the lane, gets oh. the floater to fall over Looney. Tough how, shot. I'll tell you, how tough is that? They are tough. See who's on the floor then. Melton throws it away. Ellis with the steal, sees the clock, takes it in, and throws it down. Buddy Heald fit right in with... The Warriors' offensive style in the first half hits another threes. Five for five from behind the arc. And obviously the expectations are going to be high for him trying to, along with other players. And here comes Pachemski. Nice pass by Pachemski, and the corner three goes for Moody. Just came out the other day to repeat in 2025. Pajemski got Len off his feet, fires to Kaminga, and Kaminga wow. on target tonight, three of five from deep. And make a .5 second decision. That's Pajemski. There's Isaac Jones, nice feet underneath. Mike Brown looked up to, to Kembe for what he meant to his country as a player, but also his work in the community. Another three for the Warriors, that by Moody, and a foul about the belief that he has instilled in the other guys, just his presence at practice. And here we're seeing tonight in preseason as Len gets the tip in. It was a teammate of Bronny James. Obviously, Bronny's presence with the Lakers, a big story as he and LeBron will become the first father-son combination in NBA history by Gary Payton. Here's Melton, who had a really good first half in his Warriors debut, and he cans a three. And so Melton's got four triples. 12 Keon Ellis, not a difference maker, but a smart team defender. Melton banks it in, and so that's the first two-point basket for Melton. He's got 14 points. Versus how fast Steph Curry gets that. Or Clay, yeah, it's a little, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's filling the role of Clay Thompson at times, yes. The, uh, the, the catch and shoot. But the slow-mo nickname is appropriate. Yep. And he embraces it. Oh, yeah. Twitter handle and everything as Melton hits again on the turnaround. And one key player, Doris, Andrew Wiggins, in that run defensively. Not available tonight. He's been under the weather, so he is not practicing until this week. But I do think, you know, there's more that goes into it. Like, I remember Jeff Van Gundy talking about this all the time. Sometimes there's a little luck involved. How healthy are you? New coach Mike Budenholzer takes over for Frank Vogel. I think they're going to win an awful lot of regular season games and be well positioned. This pass by Moody. In the Shot clock at three. Isaac Jones drives nice. and finishes. There's that potential that yeah. Ron told us about pregame. Now a member of the Dallas Mavericks. He will return to Chase Center for the first time November 12th. Out the basket and one, so an old-fashioned three-point chance here for Guy Santos. On three minutes to go. These teams will play in the preseason again in a couple of nights up in San Francisco. And points off the bench for Sacramento. Nice move by Isaac Jones. Well, as far as preseason games go, this is a as good as it gets offensively, no doubt. for the Golden State Warriors.